Hello, everyone. We have breaking news in the criminal investigation into the Midland County Sheriff's Office. We have just obtained documents showing the Midland County District Attorney's Office executed a search warrant at the Sheriff's Office. Tatum Gwynn has been pouring through the documents all afternoon. Tatum, what have you learned? Crystal DPS released this search warrant to us this afternoon after an open records request. It was issued at the beginning of October after a peace officer employed by the Midland County District Attorney's Office requested it. The warrant gave permission to search the Midland County Inf Information Technology Department. The reason? Probable cause based on what that officer believed was unlawful interception of oral or electronic communications at that location. The county IT department maintains the telephone system for all Midland County employees, including the Sheriff's Office. The document states there was a computer screen that showed Sheriff's Office employees were listening to phone conversations. According to the warrant, the county phone system does not contain any warnings or disclaimers that phone conversations are being recorded, and employees are not informed that their phone conversations are being recorded either. The Midland County District Attorney's Office issued that warrant to search the specific electronic phone records of employee Deborah Nichols between April of 2018 and October of 2019. That's the phone line they believe shows evidence of illegal wiretapping. The employee named in the search warrant is also the same employee who filed a civil lawsuit against Midland County. Deborah Nichols filed that suit last week in Midland District Court claiming that her phone line was illegally tapped hundreds of her calls listened to. You'll also remember that the Texas Rangers did not open their criminal investigation until November. This warrant right here issued in October.